Greetings, Amadora Valley High School seniors. We are so excited for you with your baccalaureate and your upcoming graduation. My name is Hina Khan Mukhtar and I'm speaking on behalf of the Muslim Community Center in Pleasanton. We would like to congratulate you on a, all the perseverance and patience and resilience that you guys have shown this past year. The whole world has been struggling with this pandemic and I know that we all know that you guys must be a little disappointed by the senior year not turning out exactly how maybe you guys had envisioned, but all your teachers and your families have been rallying around you to give you the best year possible. And I wanted to share with you the Islamic perspective on how we're supposed to respond to different situations that we find ourselves in life in order to have success. So there's four situations you can find yourself in life. The first is you can find yourself in a situation where you have a lot of blessings, everything's going well, exactly the way you want, life is great. The second situation is that you're in trials and tribulations, life is difficult and you, there are a lot of challenges. The third situation is that you're in a state of obedience to God where you're doing what's expected of you and you're quote unquote behaving. And the fourth situation is a state of obedience to God where you're following the rules and doing what's expected of you. So every one of these situations, according to the Islamic perspective, requires a certain response. And if you know the correct response to the situation that you find yourself in, then we're told by our teachers that you're on a good track, on the path to God and on, to, on the path of your Lord's um, pleasure, divine pleasure. So what are the responses to the four different situations you could find yourself in? If you find yourself that you're obeying God, your response is supposed to be witnessing your blessings and not becoming arrogant or self-righteous or sanctimonious. If you find yourself in a state of disobedience to God, then your response is supposed to be one of repentance and asking for forgiveness and changing your ways. If you find yourself in a state of blessings, then you're supposed to show gratitude and be grateful and just thank God for everything that you've been given. And if you find yourself in a state of trials and tribulations, which many of us have found ourselves in this past year, then the response is supposed to be patience and perseverance and knowing that this too shall pass. And so I wanted to remind you all that hope is around the corner. There's a light at the end of the tunnel. You guys are out of high school and you're on to good things and you're going to be grateful for everything that was done for you and given to you these past four years and now you're going to continue to patiently persevere and you're going to see all sorts of blessings come raining down on you and the muslims in our your community are standing with you wishing you the best god bless you and have a wonderful graduation